everyone, Maximus McCullough with Avon Website Pro here. And today we're going to learn to run our websites through Cloudflare. Okay, so you'll notice whenever you log on to Cloudflare, you can create a free plan. Up here it says add a site. So we're just going to go ahead and click that. And we're going to add Maximus McCullough just like that okay make sure it's spelled right and click add the site now <clears throat> it'll start out by querying the DNS re records the domain name system and it's gonna see where it's pointed to now and we're just gonna click next down here and we're gonna select our plan we're gonna go with the free plan we're gonna select confirm plan now you'll notice that it's looking to, uh, this is where you can put your A records, uh, if you're gonna have email with the site, you can do your MX record. Notice it has a C name record of www, and that's pointed to MaximusMcCullough.com too. So if anybody types in www.MaximusMcCullough.com, it'll go to that site. This is the time to live. Cloudflare has something called automatic, I think it's 600 seconds. And the status, sometimes it runs through Cloudflare. And if you click that, it'll take it so it doesn't run through Cloudflare. Okay, but we want it to run through Cloudflare. Okay, once we do that, we'll click continue. Now, you'll notice here, it grabs the name servers that the domain is using now. But since we want to go through Cloudflare, we want to use these two name servers. So we're going to go ahead and copy this, the first name server. We're going to navigate our way over to our domains. And you're going to be in domains at your A1 Website Pro Registrar. You'll come down, click the domain name where you're using with MaximusMcCullough.com. Okay, next we're going to go ahead and scroll down after that loads up. And click Manage DNS. Now once your DNS is loaded up, what you're going to do is you're going to scroll down to where it says NS, Name Server. Okay, and we want to change these, but we don't change them here. Notice there's no pencil mark. So we go ahead and scroll down and where it says Name Servers. We want to use, we want to change it. We're going to take from default and we're going to select Custom. And we're going to put our first uh, name server in here that we got from Cloudflare. Go ahead back and copy that again for some reason. Did not copy. There we go. And then I'm going to go back and I'm going to get that second name server. And we will put paste that in right here. And we're going to go ahead and click save. Now, all this other stuff up here does not matter. Where we have our A name, C name, stuff like that, because now Cloudflare is taken over the DNS. Now what we want to do once we uh, change the name servers is click continue. Cloudflare is going to confirm <clears throat> that it's pointing uh, to them so then they can take control. And uh, now we're ready to go ahead and uh, we can manage the DNS records in here if we like. If we scroll to the top, we click DNS, just confirm that it is pointing to your server and we can see that it's pointed to my server's IP address and it's taken it through Cloudflare. And that's pretty much it. And if we go to MaximusMcCullough.com, I have it loaded up here, I'll just refresh it. We can still see that it's being pointed to our website. And that's all there is to it by at, for uh, using Cloudflare as your domain name system instead of your uh, Avon Website Pro account or any other account. It works this way pretty much uh, across the platform. This is Max with Avon Website Pro. I hope this was able to help somebody out. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.